Canada's made a huge investment in immigration. Immigration's had a huge impact in Toronto, right here in the university, but all across the city. The success of our immigration experiment, if you like, is uh, really going to be the story of the future of the country. So I, for me, it's a fascinating uh, subject. Internationally, uh, immigration is a huge issue in virtually every industrial country, and they are controversial almost everywhere. Uh, the Canadian case is interesting because uh, Canada is the only country in which immigration is popular. The immigration program actually has the support of the majority of the population, and uh, you know the world looks at this and sees what seems to be a success story. So uh, I think it's an important question of you know whether uh, the the situation in Canada is what it is perceived to be, and if so, why is that? What is the reason? Another issue that I think is important, doing research on topics where public opinion is one uh, thing and uh, the social reality is another, and one of them has to do with uh, the Muslim population. Uh, because, you know, the public opinion polls show that many Canadians are very concerned that Muslims are, do not want to integrate into uh, the society and they're not doing that. So it's interesting to look at the evidence on this question. And what you find is that, in short, they are assimilating, you know, far from the public perception of a group that is creating an enclave, insulated from the rest of the society. Our approach, our multicultural approach, which is supposed to allow people not to assimilate, actually works more effectively as, <laughs> as an assimilation model. Policies which are directed at Muslims to try to bring them in line uh, may backfire, and we should understand that our uh, what's happening with the Muslim community in Canada today is actually not different from Hindus, other groups, you know, they are integrating into the mainstream and I think part of our uh, success is due to the, uh, the willingness of Canadians to, uh, to provide services in support of immigration. I think it does have an effect.